Hey everybody, this is Chris Glitzos, known as a wood tinkerer. Today is my 2x4 challenge of 2016. Taking a rough measurement of the screwdriver so this way it will not bottom out once the project is complete. To shape the handle you could use a nice wooden rasp. I decided to save a lot of time by using the router. It really really came out really nice and round. Almost finished. There are no shortcuts when it comes down to sanding. Sanding will add a nice soft touch. This is a handle after all. You want the grip to be very comfortable while you're holding it. Prior to start drilling where every tool is going to be placed, take careful measure and think it out through. Once you start drilling, and if mistakes are done, there's no turning back. So think it through all the way. Fabricating a small parts tray to keep storage of a few items underneath the tool caddy.
glue up is my favorite part of all. This is where all the parts that are fabricated come together for an end result. No tool caddy will be complete without a pencil holder. For a finish, my decision was to add a butcher block or cutting board oil. I just wanted to keep it natural. And there we have it. This is my entry to the 2016 Summers Woodworking Challenge of 2x4. By the way, this is all that was left out of the 2x4. Now, this was inspired. Reason being is all summer long, everybody's building these beautiful beer caddies that give away as friends. I decided to make a tool caddy for it. And it's a nice desk organizer. Another reason is at Simple Woodworking Creations, for us clarity, I want the Stanley screwdrivers and I want to put them to good use and I want to keep them for years to come. And I just didn't want them laying around and that inspired the whole project. So, if you like my channel, please tell a friend. If this is your first time, please subscribe. Please do leave comments below and a thumbs up is all we appreciate it. In the meantime, God bless and good luck to everybody with 20